Good afternoon. My name's Howard Hellwinkle and I'm with the Westchester County Tea Party. We're going to caravan today over to Stanford, Connecticut and join a protest with the Patriots from Connecticut who are protesting President Obama and his policies. He'll be there to do a fundraiser with the top 1% in this country, the people that he demonizes and villain it and calls the villains. He's going to take their money to run for office. We're going to stow across the street and we're going to let them know we don't like Thank you everybody for being here. Thank you for inviting us. I know many speakers have spoken to you today, so I'm not going to talk to you. I want to talk to you people over there that are going in to give Obama money. Let's look at the facts. Obama is bad for the United States. Obama will not be a good investment. Let me put it to you simple and clear. If you've got some money that you're going to give Obama, put it in a six-month CD, because after the new president comes in next year, the economy will grow and you can make a better investment. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody yeah. you're going to give it tonight, you're throwing down the rat hole. His policies are bad. His economic policies do not work. Keynesian theory does not work. It was proved back in the 1930s. You cannot take money that don't exist, put it into economies, and expect the economy to grow. You cannot take money from those who are the producers, put it into an economy, and give it to those who are not producing, and expect the economy to grow. The economy only grows by growth of production from within, from the markets. But what Obama's doing is distorting the market, taking future bubbles and pushing them down the road so our children will have to experience them. Let's talk about his spending policies. He is spending money that we don't have. He is creating it out of thin air, and it will have to be paid back eventually by our children. By you. The only thing that can happen then is they have to increase the taxes so that people will leave America, or America will not be what it is. You can inflate our currency to pay back the debt, and then you have a destroyed economy. You can ask for debt forgiveness like these African and South American countries have done, where you go to renegotiate your debt with the Chinese. Guess how that's gonna work? Let's look at his, his energy policy. He is stifling growth in America, Increasing the cost of fuel by not allowing us to drill in our own waters. He's not allowing us to drill in the wastelands in Alaska. And he's not allowing us to put the pipeline through the United States, which the Canadians want to give us oil, even after Keystone rerouted the pipeline around the environmentally sensitive area. He's not an environmentalist. He's trying to hurt America. His policies are bad. Let's look at his foreign policy. The first thing he did when he came into office, he took down the missile defense shield for Eastern Europe. Then what did he do recently? He allowed leaks to come out of the United States about a successful operation on a fire, on a cyber attack that we had on Iran. He let it leak out. Iran now knows we're at war with him. He told him. Let me tell you guys over there, before you put your hands in your pocket and give them any money, just remember that money is not going to help America. Obama is bad for America. You're wasting your money. Don't do it. Change your mind. Eat his food for free and leave.